Hey guys, Vince here from Auto Industria and we've got something very different for you today. Now, some are wondering, how do car makers get their fuel efficiency numbers? What goes into the drives and what special techniques do they employ? Well, with our friends from Fuso, we thought we'd show you with a new canter. We are very excited as our Fuso Fuel Eco Challenge will commence today. The goal of this activity is to demonstrate the unique selling point of our PUV, which is fuel efficiency and vehicle performance. Our initiative to be showcase the efficiency of our vehicle under normal driving condition for the benefit of the operators and driver. Every fuel eco run starts and finishes at a fuel station. The intent here is that we fill up the tank to the brim, let all the bubbles come out and then fill it up again so that it's absolutely all fuel inside. You drive around or drive a certain route and then at the end of it, you get how much you consumed versus the distance you traveled. That's how you get your final number. Now let's go drive. Normally when car makers do these fuel eco runs, they try to get the best conditions possible. Like expressway, no traffic, and you're usually at 2 a.m. when there's really no sunlight to deal with, no heat. But not Fuso. They wanted to set real world fuel economy numbers. That's why we're not on the expressway, we're on the provincial highway. There's also traffic all around us. It's also high noon, which means we have the AC on. We're doing this to set real numbers not some really, really high numbers just for the sake of it. At the end of the day, we'll find out if it's all worth it. The vehicle that Fuso chose for this drive is the Cantor. You all know it. This one has the three liter 4P10 turbo diesel engine powering it. It's all stock. There are no special modifications. But of course, the version we're driving in, it's the modern PUV class three. That means more comfortable seating, AC, you've got CCTV to protect you, and most importantly, you've got Wi-Fi. And now the moment of truth. We have already refilled the canter and now we're checking what the fuel economy is. Mr. Art of the Automobile Association of the Philippines is now doing his computation. Sir, no pressure, no pressure. Okay guys, we are back here in Fuso, Pampanga and drum roll please because we are about to get the official numbers. Sir Art? Sir Art is one of the stewards from the Automobile Association of the Philippines and he is very experienced with observing official fuel economy runs. Wow! Okay, so we drove a total distance of 152.7 kilometers and we achieved a fuel economy rating of 8.8 .8 kilometers per liter. Now some of you may be wondering, that seems kind of low. And the reason for that, that number is actually a real world one. We had everything on this drive, poor weather, so we had traffic, we had normal driving, we had ups and downs in the mountains, speed bumps that we did not expect, extra passengers, and so many more. There were no special tricks employed on this drive, normal tire pressure, normal driving, and actually maximum aircon. You can go on and visit any of Fuso's many outlets nationwide to test drive the canter for yourself. Thank you for watching. This is Vince of AutoIndustria.com.